Thank you, Madam Speaker, colleagues. In light of the recent Secretary of State's audit of our social welfare system, I would like to speak about a bill that would help solve some of the problems associated with fraud within the system. House Bill 3322 would remove TANF, which is the Temporary Assistance for Needy Family Funds, from being placed onto prepaid credit cards. It is my belief that tax dollars being used to fund TANF should be specifically directed toward only items and services needed for basic survival, like housing, food, and absolute personal necessities. TANF, as properly used, can be an important aspect for families with children that are struggling in this prolonged recession. We need to remain vigilant as legislators to make sure it is being utilized as such. As TANF is presently structured in Oregon, the funds may be used in any way desired by its recipients. We have heard anecdotal experiences from constituents related to TANF funds, which were converted to cash visa cards and then used for the purchase of electronics, such as flat-screened televisions and computers. Additional cases nationwide show TANF cards being used for luxury travel, such as paying for vacation cruises, as well as being sent out of the U.S. to foreign countries for use by non-Oregonians. When the TANF cards leave Oregon as prepaid visa or other prepaid cards, they are leaving our economy and leaving the intended recipients. Oregon's TANF caseload has essentially doubled in the last five years, and with that increase comes the potential for even more fraud and abuse. TANF costs per case for the years 13-14 are projected at $477 per month. Thank you.